Hi guys, this is Gaming Guy Thomas here, and today we're going to be doing part six, I believe, of Tomb Raider One. All right, so we are in the tomb of Qualapec, where we're going to collect the first piece of the ski on. All right, so when you enter, uh, you see this large room. Now, basically, um, down here are three gates. And basically you have to complete a certain puzzle to unlock all three of them. And um, up here, there is um, like a slope or something. And um, basically, as soon as you run up there, a ball is going to come down. I'm going to set that. Uh oh. I just let it go. Um, we won't have to worry about that later. Alright, so... Yeah, basically, there's a switch right here, which is going to open uh, this part in the wall right here. And that's also going to spawn a couple of Velociraptors. Better take them out quick. Ah. Alright. Alright, so just um, come down here. Alright, now this is um, the, the three rooms where we're going to have to complete a certain puzzle to unlock one of the gates. So I'm going to start off with the Phoenix. I'm assuming that's a Phoenix because I, I watch Harry Potter. Alright, so when you come in here, you'll notice a switch and you also notice this big room with a couple of platform there's two of them alright so first thing you want to do is pull the switch if I can and that moves one of them and oh my goodness alright and then just hop down here <clears throat> and then go through down this corridor And you're now standing on one of the pillows, I'm assuming that's what they're called. Alright, and then, jump up here. And jump up here. And again, jump up, jump up here. Okay. I think, um, let me just hop down a sec. Alright, so yeah, as you can see, we are uh, down here. But the thing is that we don't want to uh, jump down there and jump on that platform just yet because uh, we need to go through the corridor on the wall on the right, which we cannot access yet. So what we want to do is... Oh, dang it. They took damage there. Um, come through here, and basically this is the same area where we came in, and then pull this switch up, and that moves it back, and we are now able to access that place you just saw in that small cinematic, like so. All right, so I can just jump up here. And there's going to be a switch. And that moves the same block. And then you can just hop down. And then, once you've done that, just climb back up here. And then, go back up here. Oh wait a minute, no wait, sorry, let me go back. Okay, before you do that, pull the switch right here. Almost missed that for a sec. Alright, and then... Now basically the reason why we had to pull that switch is because cause it 
moves that block right there we are now able to access that over there that switch where we can just jump on the platforms yeah so obviously this part you need to be very careful you don't want to like mess this up and fall in the spikes so um, I think this is good Alright. So that opens the first switch, and that also spawned a Velociraptor in the same area. Alright, so on this part, you want to be careful because you don't want to like run off this and fall in the spikes, so or just jump. And you should be fine. Alright, so let me just take my guns out and have a piece of this. Velociraptor. Where are you? Come out. Ah. Uh. Is it dead? Oh. Yeah, it's dead. Alright, so I'm gonna go for this one. Oh, actually, um, I'm gonna save it because I don't wanna, like, die on this part. Alright now, yeah as, obviously as you can see there's a switch, but you can't pull that switch, I don't think it does anything, and there's a false platform which is going to lead you to a room f filled with wolves, and that is where we want to go, I'm going to select my shotgun, which I have 14 shots of, alright let's go. Ah, dang it, fire! Bad wolvies. Wolverines. Oh, for goodness sake, turn around. There we go. Took me a while. Um, I don't think there's 